All right, welcome to the channel. Today we're going to do a quick overview of some purchased Amazon items. Starting with the foot plate that replaces the wheel when you're camping, you can put this down on a more solid foundation. Next up, we have the uh, Blackstone grill cover and carrying bag to protect your investment for the Blackstone grill. It's a great handy covering to have. Next up is the foam tiles. These are tw uh, 24 by 24. You only need uh, two packages or 12 to cover the runaway trailer, six by eight. Next up is the <laughs> three bottle liquor station. Allows you to pour your drinks a lot better so that you can uh, serve your guests a heck of a lot faster than pouring one bottle at a time. Great little item to have in your bar. All right, next up is the, uh, this is just a four in one car charger unit that uh, allows you to, has a battery meter and a switch, allows you to turn on and off your charging station. All right, next we have the uh, temperature sensor that you plug into your Renogy um, solar power controller to monitor your battery sensor uh, temperature, is all that is. Next we have just a great little digital uh, meter that monitors both your voltage and input, output, uh, all that kind of stuff. Now you don't actually need this, but if you want to keep an eye on what you're using up, great a little item to have. Okay, next we have the, this is emergency LED road flares, a lot safer to handle. Just needs three LED, uh, AAA batteries is all it takes. These are great to have in any vehicle. All right, next we have just a six foot a hose that converts your one pound tanks that you would plug in your Blackstone griddle or any griddle uh, to plug into a 20 pound propane tank. Okay, next we have the security and anti rattler rattle kit that uh, <clears throat> makes for a lot smoother ride. Uh, I put this on mine and let me tell you, it was nice and quiet and never heard the trailer rattle or bounce at all on the hitch whatsoever. Great little item to have. Okay, next we have the Blackstone Griddle. <laughs> this is a great item. If you don't have one, get one. You'll love it. Okay, next is just the stabilizing jack pads that you put under your um, jack stands at the back or and also up at the front if you bought the flat panel, flat uh, one that I bought. Okay, also wheel chucks just to keep your wheels from rolling back and forth always need a set of those okay everybody's favorite need a dehumidifier to put in your trailer uh, during those winter months when you're not camping to prevent moisture from building up inside your trailer this is just a little thermometer digital tells you the temperature and humidity gauge that's all that is nice little extra thing to have in your trailer Okay, next up is the, <clears throat> just a uh, T section or T level you mount to the front of your trailer. Make it easy to level your vehicle as you're driving along. Okay, here we have a 252 box of straws and mixers and stirrers and umbrellas. Great little thing to have in your bar, <laughs> especially if your trailer is named Tiki, you're gonna have a Tiki bar, so that's what I bought this for. All right, yeah, it's a lot of items in there. It was a great day actually. Ordered this and have fun with it. Okay, next up is the 100 watt uh, Renogy solar starter kit. Basically, everything you need to get started, other than a battery. Now you could put some fuses in it. I'm not gonna go into detail, but great little starter kit to buy. Uh, to go with the Tiki bar, I bought some, some bar service spill mats to put on my bar 
these were just some fun items I bought here just to, you know, make round eggs and round pancakes a little neater and cleaner. Just thought it'd be something fun to have. Uh, this is the accessory kit I bought for the Blackstone Griddle. I've used this already, and let me tell you, everything in there works great. Okay, next up we have the Tiki Bar Rules. <laughs> so, if you're like me, you'll probably want to follow some of these. Uh, next up is the sign, the Tiki Bar sign. This is two of the signs I'll have up on my trailer or in the camping area. Okay, next up is everyone's favorite, least subject to talk about, the porta potty. I already bought this, I've already used it, it works fabulous. Very easy to maintain, clean, and dispense. Uh, these I haven't really used yet, they're outside solar powered lights to go on the outside of the trailer. Everybody needs a portable collapsible washing bin. There you go. I got it in that particular blue. Uh, just some Coleman string lights that I felt like uh, would be fun to have around the campsite. Battery powered. Uh, I thought this was going to be bigger than what I thought it was, but it's not. It's a little tiny small mess kit. And made for one person, basically. Okay, next up, this was the fuse panel bar that I bought. Uh, when I get ready to wire my trailer, I'll install this and I'll have plenty of room to uh, expand in the future of anything I need to put uh, in the trailer. But mainly this is going to be running 12 volt sockets, lights, all the fun stuff inside. So we'll see how this one works out. Great little card game called Karma. If you've never gotten this one, I highly recommend you have this in your game bag, in your trailer. You will love it. Okay, bought these four little portable LED uh, camp lights. They're just great for hanging around. I use them in the tent. They uh, work fine. Just uses um, two or three AA batteries. So, great for emergency backup. And the Jackery. I bought the 240. Uh, probably will need the 500 at some point. But right now I have just the 240, and uh, it's so far it's been doing pretty good. So I might get another one or a larger one. That is all. Be sure to like, subscribe, and um, leave comments below. Thank you. Mm -hmm.